What's going on YouTube? It's Keating. Today I'm bringing you a brand new video. Um, it's about a glitch on the map Santa Marie du Mont. Um, it's a very interesting glitch. You can get completely out of the map. Um, and right now I'm doing a live voiceover. Um, I know this is way different from what I usually do. Uh, but we're going to jump right into it here. Um, so what you're going to want to do is go on the other side of the map where that green truck is. You're going to have to jump right up on that. Hop up on the sandbag ledge, and what you're going to do is like sort of like a strafe jump um, around the sandbags. Um, and that's pretty much the hardest part about the glitch. Once you do that, you have to back up on the ledge just a tiny bit, and then go to the left. And then um, once you're able to do that, you're going to jump from bag to bag, onto the fence, and then onto the second fence right there. Once you're there, it, you're completely free to do whatever you want. You could hop up onto the highest part of the roof like I'm doing right now. Um, and you can use that spot alone. Like, that spot right there is phenomenal. You can get so many kills in, in different game modes and stuff for it. Um, and it's, it's very, very, you know, an in, in-depth glitch to do it. I made it look easy in the video, but it, trust me, it took me over 150 tries to do. Um, but, you know, once you've got the hang of it, it's actually awesome to do. Now this next part you're about to see is very, very cool. This is how you get completely outside of the map. You have to remember, you have to have the basic training on that makes you have no falling damage at all. Um, because if you don't have that uh, basic training on, you're going to fall off the map and you're going to die. And you're going to be angry because you you did that whole glitch and you couldn't explore the outside of the map. And just take that uh, as a um, advice because I did that a couple times <laughs> until I forgot uh, and until I remembered to put it back on. So it was terrible. Uh, but you know, once once we uh, finally got it, it, it was super cool to explore. You guys are gonna really enjoy this. Um, I highly suggest doing it before they patch it because I'm sure on the next update they will have it patched. Um, now it's, it's it's super fun to explore the outside of the map. <clears throat> right now I'm showing you, you know. Obviously, I'm outside of the barrier. When you hit the start button, you look at the mini map, or not the mini map, the, the full blown map, you can see that I'm completely outside of the map. And now you, you have pretty much free range once you're outside of the map to do whatever you want. It is such a big place you can sp explore. So, what I was doing was just walking around the entire place and just checking it out and seeing, like, uh, you know, the outside of the map. Because personally, I haven't done a glitch video where you can get outside of the map since Call of Duty World, World at War. And back then I never streamed or broadcast or recorded. I didn't do anything like that. So I just did the glitch just to do it and have fun. Um, so I really, really enjoyed this video a lot. And um, it really brought back memories trying to get outside of maps and stuff like that. And it's super, super cool um, that you can just have free range and explore the complete outside of the map when, you know, it's just not supposed to be there. But um, like I said, I, I do highly suggest giving it a try. Um, it it'll take a lot of tries. I was getting very frustrated while filming this video. Uh, but I was very happy once I was able to do it. And... Um, it's, it's super cool once you're actually outside of the map because, like I said, you have free range to go anywhere you want. And towards the end of this video here, you're going to see a interesting um, drop-off, I want to call it. So once you explore, once you go towards, once I go straight down this road and make a left towards the church, I start walking down a path, right, and, and it takes me to this grassy area. I guess once you move to a certain point, it'll drop you completely off of the map. And you can literally just like look up and see them. And see, you're falling, but you won't die at all. You'll just you'll, you'll literally fall into a pit of darkness. Um, it's pretty pretty crazy looking, uh, but you keep just keep falling down and falling down. And you can shoot your gun. You can look up at the map above you. Um, I don't believe you can really get kills and stuff like that because it happens so fast. Uh, but it's a super 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 interesting um, glitch. And like I said, I highly suggest you guys trying to do it. Uh, but that's going to do it, guys. I'm going to let you enjoy the rest of the video. Uh, there should be only a couple more minutes left. If you guys did enjoy the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you have any questions or anything about how, how to get the glitch or how to get how to do the glitch, just leave in the comment section below. I'll try to help you guys out to the best of my ability. I know this voiceover is kind of funky. Usually when I record my videos, I like to do it uh, in real time. I don't, you know, do a voiceover or anything like that. But I actually recorded the video without any voice or anything because I was just trying to concentrate on doing the glitch itself. Um, so like I said, I do apologize about the voiceover. Um, I know I kind of rushed through the actual glitch part or how to do the glitch part. So if you guys have any questions about it, just let me know. I'll be more than happy to help. 